Hey, what's up guys? I'm Taylor. I'm Jeff. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button and make sure you like this video. Today, we're doing a fun video. A very fun game that we've been talking about doing for a while. Yeah. I'm nervous, I'm going to be dreadfully embarrassed, but maybe not. I feel like I'm gonna be more embarrassed. We'll see. We'll see. So today we are actually gonna go through each other's old Instagram photos pre-meeting. Mm-hmm. And we're gonna give each other a, a little, light roast, yeah, if a you light will. Roast. But before we get into that, I wanna give a shout out to today's sponsor, Pear Eyewear. Pear <laughs> Eyewear. Wow. Where you can change <gasps> sunglasses. I didn't know that. You can change the top of your frames with like thousands of different varieties. Yeah. I've never seen glasses like these. So I've had the same frames, the same glasses for probably four years. Yeah. So I found pair and these were only, these are prescription mm -hmm. and these were only $60. Is and that, I don't wear glasses? That's like very That's good, okay, great. You can't find prescription we love glasses a deal. for that price. And then all of the top frames are only $25. Nice. So like, this is like when I'm like feeling like corporate mm -hmm. and like very proper, mm -hmm. like my day to day. I'm feeling like fun and flirty. Oh. Maybe I'm feeling Maybe a little a... party girl adventure. Yeah, we're gonna go see Wicked. Maybe. Yeah. This is like kind of like, you know, maybe I'm in a coffee shop doing work. I'm oh, like yeah. a little fun and flirty, but yeah, yeah. a little proper. Always so flirty. Well, and then this is like when I'm out and about riding that, my bicycle. I think that is my favorite. The fact that you can snap on sunglasses. Yeah, it's amazing. And I don't need to carry like a bunch of different pairs. Anyway. Pairs. See what I did there? Check out Pair Eyewear. We have a code for 15% off right below. And tell me what you think. Yeah, great. Cool. Are you gonna wear those? You're gonna pull up Paris Hilton and wear them all, all the whole video? I might switch it up if that's okay. I love that. So now let's get into the nitty gritty. I think you should go first because I want you to set the tone of what the vibe is gonna be. I wanna see how hard I can roast you based on how, how what you do to me. So a couple years ago, I actually archived a lot of my old Instagrams, Most, mostly like everything from college, everything from pre-New York, I sort of archived it, mm -hmm. but I, I let Jeff into the archives to mm. roast me fairly. I'm nervous. Shall I begin? Go for it. I wanna start with, um, <sighs> A confusing photo. Okay. This is yeah the straightest photo I've ever that's a, seen. You think that's the straightest one? Taylor, this is a photo that straight men put on hinge. Yeah. To I, attract females. What's funny is, so I'm holding a grouper. I was deep sea fishing off uh, out, out in the Keys. And that grouper, I pulled it up so fast from the bottom of the ocean that that is its stomach. I know, because the it pressure. Popped out, yeah. I just, like, I don't know what to say. I just, this is attracting the wrong personnel, if you will. I was doing just fine. Did you have to throw it back? Oh, yeah. But the thing is, I think it was. Because of the stomach? Yeah, but it wasn't in season, so I couldn't, I couldn't take it. That's sad. But you provided food for. Yeah, for a uh, shark. Yeah. Okay, good start. Just to start it off, I'm gonna start with. Jeff's first ever Instagram photo. No caption, nothing, just dead in the sand, posted <laughs> March 16th, 2012. This was 10 years ago. This was your first post. What was going through your mind? You okay. think anyone was ever gonna see this? I just like, nah, that wasn't shade. That was like. It sounded like shade. Captions weren't a thing back then. Could you? Oh, oh, but <laughs> they turned into a thing. I'll, uh, and I'll read you on those. Later. I was at my grandparents' place in Florida, mm -hmm. and I was like, I'm feeling good. I'm gonna post a picture of me mm -hmm. from the First side. You said, this is a new, this is a maybe, new thing. Maybe I originated the selfie. I don't know. I, it looks like it was it was giving Nashville filter as well. Probably. Okay. Instagram filters were like really big back then. I, I had the Nashville filter on with the, the frame, because you could do the frame on and off. Next photo. Are you just, Are you going chronological or random? I don't know. <laughs> it's this one. <laughs> I look good there. You look hefty. I do look hefty. I was that was my drinking face. It's giving it's giving it's, power power it, political couple. It's giving National Republic convention. Oh no. It's giving yeah. I'm running for 
board of the treasurer. I had a massive American flag hanging up in my dorm room. That was my date. It's giving like young debaters club. Hey, if we were going to a date party. We look Who good. is she? Was she your date? Yeah. Miss Jess Clark. She's now married to Ben Higgins. Oh my bachelor. God. She's great. Did you kiss her? Babe, she's married now. Okay. And I'm married now too. I, come on. Now I'm blushing. She looks very nice. I, my caption was vote for us. So I, I, I knew what I was doing. All right, we've got just a boy bouncing around Disney World with Goofy. <laughs> if you could just zoom in and check out the face on him and um, the front tuck. The long, okay. pale yellow shorts. The year was 2013. I was, that was all in. I went you with were my very family. Excited. I went with my family and I love Goofy. Yeah. Goofy was my, my character. Yeah. When I was really little, <laughs> like we went to one of those character breakfasts and he- Breakfasts? Breakfasts. And he, he didn't leave me alone and I kept following him around and so it was, the rest was history. love. But the captions do come into play. Let's just keep My on. captions, I imagine, are very funny. I'm trying so. not to look because I want to be genuinely surprised, but you're already scrolling past some Okay, this one was really funny just because of the caption. Oh my, stop! <laughs> this is my favorite <laughs> job ever. Okay, you and a bunch of kids. Okay. You kneeling on the ground like- It was the, fi it was the finals? It was like the it finals? Like it was make or break caption. It, it was make or break. Caption. Couldn't have asked for a better team these past two weeks. Proud of these kids for taking home the championship. Yeah, and they won. So I worked at the Macaulay School in Chattanooga. It was an all boys boarding school, but I worked their sports program over the summer. And those were all like eight and nine year old kids who had met, they were on a two week away from home camp. And they were like my little my little kids. I respect that and it's very And cute. they won. It's just funny that like looking at that picture in the caption, like you would have thought like this was the Super Bowl. To them, it was. Could not have asked. And I couldn't have. For a better. I was thinking those kids are like driving now probably. <sighs> That's crazy. You got a, a view from Columbus Circle and it says Columbus Circle from the 73rd floor. Hashtag NYC, hashtag Columbus sailed the ocean blue, hashtag 1492. I love that poem. It, you were ahead of your time. You're a travel influencer. I was a travel influencer. What can I say? Cool photo. It's yeah, a cool yeah, photo. Yeah, it's cool. It's cool. It's fun. It's fun. It's fun and flirty. So flirty. <laughs> Should I be worried? Okay, this is one of my favorite pictures. Okay, this is good, a nice good, one. Good, good. You look so cute here and so young. Let me see. Those freckles. Uh, yeah, I shaved for that. That was one of my first like modeling test shoots. For what? That photo is highly edited though, because when I I would look at that and I'm like, dang, my skin. It's it does poppin'. not look like that. For what it's worth, it's never too late. Okay, my, that, that's my favorite quote. Or in my case, too early to be whoever you want to be. There's no time limit. From, Stop whenever you want. You can change or stay the same. It's from Benjamin Button. I was going oh. through a breakup. I mean, you look very cute and adorable. Thanks. So, that's your nice one. Okay, here, I have a good one. Popsicles in Central Park. Hashtag no filter. Hashtag NYC. Hashtag Central Park. At Emily. Lots to digest here. You're okay. biting into a popsicle. So uh, would that be better if I was like, like licking it? The blonde hair. And were you going? Were you going through something? Or no? Just for fun. Just life. Yeah. You look cute though. 2013. Thank you. Not much has changed, to be honest. Uh, yeah. No. The hair. Yeah. Just the hair. Okay. Um, here's my next one. Oh, that's a good one. That was popular. Okay, so a few questions. Why do you have a shirt on in the shower? It was, you know, wet t-shirty vibes. Uh-huh. So if we want to talk about oh, I, the flirty. I always oh, I wanted was... to compete in a wet t-shirt contest. I was very much trying to flirt. That was, a thirst, that was a thirst trap. Same guy took that photo that took the previous one. Maybe it would have worked. It did work. I mean, you look great. It's just, you know, looking back. No, it's, it's, it's a little cringe. It's now. a little cringe. Yeah. But it's okay. Yeah, yeah, no. Yeah, that, yeah. I'm glad you're pick. I'm surprised you're not picking other ones because there are ones that I was I regretted that I sent you. Hmm. The first celeb appearance of the day, Mr. Andy Cohen. <laughs> um, oh, did you guys miss my interview on Bravo with Andy Cohen tonight? I'm the newest housewife of New Jersey. <laughs> I mean, not wrong. Man trying to manifest is what you were doing. And that's a cute photo. Are those pants or shorts? Uh. Oh no. <laughs> I, um, I'm, it was July, so they're no, shorts. No, they're shorts. 
Long end seams were in back then. I don't know. It was 2014. I'll give it you that. It was 2014, and I was straight. All right, I'll, I'm gonna do two right here because one's nice. This is one of my favorite pictures of you because it was one of the first photos when we started like chatting. It was still on your grid. Yeah. So I was like, oh, like this was a photo that I would always show my friends, but look who I'm talking to. That was the best haircut I ever got. And I, it's never looked that good since. It also looked really good there. Funny, if you zoom into my chest, I got your chest wax. I got my chest wax before that uh, because I had a shoot that week and it was like a sports shoot and I broke out in hives like completely. Okay, and then um for this one. Oh my god. Where are your pants? You left the house and you forgot your pants. Yeah. I there's a there's there was quite a few uh risque photos back in those days. When I lived in Miami, there was no rules. I had I had um I was modeling, those were all test shoots, mm -hmm. and for some reason I Thought what are you testing, okay. my patience? Right. Could you imagine me doing that now? No. That whole era of like 2017, Taylor J. Phillips, mm -hmm. different person. Mm -hmm. We've got this nice modeling shot. And you know, we love someone who gives credit to the photographer, to the hair and makeup, to the stylist, to the stylist's assistant. These are my shade blockers. And um, I know. Was, uh, what are those necklaces too? Maybe. Moving on. She's a ballerina. Oh no, which Six one? years of dance class. Oh, I love that photo. Again, Miami. It's, keep your head in the clouds and your feet on the ground. Period, stay humble. Like that was a phase where I put a lot of effort into my body and I mm. felt comfortable showing it off. I don't, I don't regret those. It's just so funny, I would never go and like pose in a, may, I don't wanna say never because I might, but it you is You look great, funny. you should be very proud of it. It's just, Funny, that literally looks like a, like a dancer. Well, you know me. Ugh. The ukulele, the the long pink same shorts. It's giving, um, let me play you a song. What was it? Sal from Love is Blind. It's cute, but like very, very straight. I was dating a girl at that point of my life. Emily? Yep. Great. I, it's a cute photo. Yeah, it's, none of them are bad. Well, hold on. Oh, that was American Psycho, baby. That was that was one of my first uh -huh. good Halloween costume. <laughs> you want me to bring up the dead referee that you went as two years ago? <laughs> I know it's a Halloween costume. I just, you know, if I didn't know the context, I'd be like, red flag. I, I mean, it was posted on um, October 31st, and it says hashtag American Psycho. Mm -hmm. But context is everything. Context is everything. Yeah, this was the first picture I saw of you. This is what this is what made me DM you. Mm -hmm. Thank and then, God. And then unsend it. Cause you didn't respond. Right. But then, so there's that one. And then there's like, I used to send this one as like, oh my God, look at this guy that I met. Look who I'm talking to. And this was your profile picture for, for like, a while forever. on Instagram. Same with this one. Mm -hmm. This is my other, I think, look, look at my, this guy. I think that's still my Facebook profile picture. And, and, and this one, like there is a, a group of them that I mm -hmm. showed. Wholesome. This is the one I sent my mom the okay. first time. That's a good mom pick. Yeah, that's a good mom pick. Yeah. Now this one, a Speedo and an American flag bathing suit. Yeah, I think that was posted, oh no. Oh, well, Memorial Day weekend, I had, a, I had a, a theme going on. You forgot the button on the shorts. No, no, that was intentional. Oh, it was intentional. 2017 uh, was about the skin, baby. The skin, mama. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I mean, great pick. Great pick, you look great, you just, you know. I did not surf, that was a prop. Yeah. Very much a prop. Oh, this is what I envision crossing over to the other side will look like. Three golden mm. retrievers, you, and you even tagged it between heaven and earth. How's <laughs> your Tuesday going? Hashtag Instagood, hashtag photo of the day, hashtag dogs of Instagram. That's when I was trying to, you know, really get some traction on my yeah. dog picture. Yeah, 2016 was... Year of growth. The year of growth. So that, that was a wholesome one. I, I like that one. That one's cute. I yeah, I mean, you couldn't see my see face, you, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm more into the dogs. Yeah. The difference between like what you're showing of me and what I'm showing of you is very funny. Now, oh, she was serving. Did you that. get the internship? That was a good, that, that was a, a suit from Zara. I shaved. Did you get the Wall Street internship? You're picking good ones. Thank you. It's funny. Um, it's just like so Wall Street finance, bro. I would your, your sh character. show me show me a man a straight man on Wall Street who's wearing a periwinkle linen suit with a floral 
But no. Your character arc. Really. What's the down part? Is that bad? No, no. Just like from where you started to where you've been to where you're at now. It's just. I feel like it's. Growth. Yeah, yeah. That's another way. Not, another graph. Bell, not bell curve. All right. This was after we had started dating, and yep. I was like, I, I might need you to take that down. Why? Not really. The fedora. I mean, what is that? It was the margaritas are better in Mexico, and that hat, and my, I think those are my glasses that you took for the trip. Okay, I still wear those glasses. I know, but the hat. Ooh, I thought it was kind of cute. Yeah, it just interesting fashion choice. But it was, fashion was never your strong suit. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> the winner of douchiest. Oh. Okay, yeah, yeah. I want, I wanted some douchiness. With the caption that. of not too shabby. Hold on. Oh, not too shabby. Smoking a cigar Ow! on a boat, yep. shirtless in Newport Beach, California. Yep. I'm giving you a douche. Yeah. Yeah, that is pretty douchey, but it was nice. I'm just. I was still I... like in the height, in my height of college, like broiness. Mm -hmm. Fraternity life. Yep. Yeah. This one is very interesting to me just because you are, you don't normally look like this, like style wise. The hair. The higher the hair, the, the closer cheek to bones. Jesus. When you throw in some shade on a Monday. What? The captions should have stayed off. <laughs> they should have been closed captions. Captions were never my strong. Suit. Yeah, even still today. Yeah. I have so much to uh, say, I don't know how to say it. Yeah. 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 Better if you don't have anything I nice better to say. I better say it in a song. You know? Thank you guys for watching. <laughs> Last first swap of the year. Oh. Oh, that was Toga Party, ATO, Find I mean, You. It's annoying because you look good in all these. They're just a little cringe. What? Oh, they're very cringe now, but in the moment, it was like, it was peak Instagram, like coming of age. And I was living my very. Are college... you confused here? Confused about what? How good I look? You look confused. No, I mean, that's called a smolder. Ah. Yeah, take some mm. notes. Right. This oh. is this is fun. Oh yeah. I don't love that photo. She's crazy. She's crazy. She's doing personalities, personality pick. This is like the Britney spinning in the foyer equivalent. Yeah, kind of. Surprise, excited for the world to meet Dylan on the last two episodes of season four of Orange is the New Black, one of the best experiences I've had so far. For those of you who don't know, Jeff has been in quite a few TV shows, and by his Instagram, you would know that he was in the last two episodes of season four of Orange is the New Black. I was excited. Yeah, as I was coming be. off on a high, and I was like, and Orange is the New Black was like a very yeah. hot show at that time. And I was like, oh my God, I'm it so still is excited. A, it still is a great show. Reading my captions back now, I'm like, oh my gosh, I would hate myself. That's why I try, when I do captions now, I either try to make it so stupid and simple or like make it informative. I used to Google sunset puns, like things like that to make it make sense to the photo, but I would, it's, that's what's the cringiest part. Yeah. Okay, um, my final one is our debut on your Instagram. The soft launch. The shelfie. The shelfie. Our first trip together, we went to Florida a couple months after dating. That's when everyone like knew. And that was our I debut. Think. Yeah. That, you posted it first. I think I waited a little longer. Yeah. Great. That was fun. That was fun. Mm -hmm. We were nicer than I thought we were. I know. Be. Well, my, you could have, if the roles had been reversed, if you had the type of photos of you that you have of me, I would have destroyed you. So I'm glad that, I'm glad that you took it easy on me. I can't be mean. I didn't have the material, really. Mm -hmm. It was more the ca I could have roasted the captions. Yeah. A nice little trip down memory lane. Yeah. Anyway, thank you for watching. Thank you again to our sponsor, Pear Eyewear. Check out their site. Uh, that is so neat. I almost wish I wore glasses. And, oh wait, I guess I could do this too <gasps> if I no. wanted to wear sunglasses. Let me see. Wow. Wow, that is cool. Wow. <laughs> Use code Taylor and Jeff 15 for 15% 15 off your order. And I, I believe it's Taylor Ampersand Jeff. Correct? It is. Okay. Yeah. But it's in the description regardless. Yeah. And we'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.